Four or Metacala Five platform. So uh, I'm gonna be releasing another video on how to use Crazy Preview, the uh, advanced way of analyzing your chart. So, but in this video, I'm gonna be showing you guys uh, using Android phone to use the Metacala Four platform. And again, about Metacala Four, this is the highly recognized platform for all traders. So you have to use this platform to get your trading. Uh, for the newbies, this video is for you, and for the uh, advanced trader too that doesn't know how to use all the tools in Metatra for, for I'm gonna be showing you step by step, guys, how to use it. Coming from the tools, the object, the indicators, everything in Metatra, uh, Metatra for, and the community uh, Metatra for how you can log in, how you can communicate with other traders, how you can meet up with other traders in the world. I'm gonna be showing you guys. Thank you. This is your Metatrader 4 platform, but first, let's go to the uh, Play Store. You want to like, uh, get your Metatrader 4, all you have to do is click Play Store, uh, search for Metatrader 4 5. So, open. This is how it's gonna be when you first open. It's gonna bring your balance out. Uh, this is an account of three dollars. So this is your uh, your currency. This is where it shows your currency. You're gonna see different currency. So first, I'm gonna show you guys how to add currency because okay. uh, it only shows five currencies uh, when you first open Metal four. So this is how you add it. Click the plus sign. Then on your broker, that different way they uh, put the currency sign. Then uh, click the FX minor. You see different currency. Just tap on it. It will be added. Then again, go to FX cross. You see different uh, this thing. Yes. Click on it to be added. Metals. This is where you can find set of gold and different other pairs. This is euro gold. Uh, different different pairs and energy. This is other oil. This is natural gas and US dollar. Brent crude and US dollar. Those for who trade oil. Do I don't trade oil? This is cryptocurrency. This is where you find Bitcoin, Ethereum, Dash, Litecoin. You can also add them if you want to be trading Bitcoin. And again, indices. These are CFDs. You can just click on them, add it uh add commodity this way you say a fine copper uh again for all these uh here people that trace cocoa and all this you can add them here so this is a pepper stone account so firstly how to log into your pepper stone account on the norms uh let me just try using a demo account so Okay, you just log into a demo account. So let me show you how you log in from your broker. Because for you to log into MetaTrader 4 account, you have to get your passwords and log in from your broker. Then you click the plus sign. Because automatically, uh, MetaTrader 4 will open a demo account for you. Then, if you want to log into your broker, look for, uh, you click the plus sign, then you see this, log into an existing account. Then you find your broker name. You can use different broker. Let's say you're looking for Pepper Stone. Uh, Pepper Stone Demo 1. This demo signifies the, uh, the account type you are given or your email or uh, sent to you. So you look for this one, you look for the account type. If you are given Demo 1, then you click Demo 1. Then you put your login, the number, then your password here. Yeah. Then you click login. And it's good to always save your password in case you forget. Again, let's try again. Uh, click the plus sign. Login to an existing account. Looking for any broker, find your broker here. Yeah. Type the broker. This is Ice Market. Put your login and your password. Then automatically, it will take you back here. Yeah. After logging in successfully, it will take you to this currency type. 
it will take you here back to this currency we paid. Then, as I said earlier, you can always add your currency from here. All this. Then your chart. How to open your chart? Let's say you want to open all GSD. Just swipe it by the left. You can only swipe it like this. If it's an Android phone, or click on it, then click open chart. But it's very more easy to swipe by the left. So uh, this is a basic chart. On the norms, this is not your chart gonna be. But out of the settings of your chart, you just have to like go to the settings, do your chart settings. Uh, put your OH LC. Then uh, you also do all these settings the way it is. If you want like my chart, way it is. Uh, and again, you have to do your chart, customize your color. You have to put a background of white and black so your chart can look. Then you can do all this, set the color the way it is. Then your chart is gonna look like mine. Then click done. Then go back to your chart. Your chart will look exactly like this. Uh, again, how to use indicators, how to put indicators on your chart. This is an indicator sign, this F sign. Click it, then click the main chart. These are different, different type of indicators. Indicators. Just add it. Just add any indicator that you're familiar with that you want to use, then you set it. Let's say you want to add uh, average uh moving average uh indicator this is the one moving average this is it. this is gonna show let's say you want to have 20 EMA there's exponential uh moving average that I use and simple EMA because that's the best that works for me. So you're just gonna add it. This is moving average. This is it's going to show exponential in this method or simple. So you can either use simple or exponential. If you have watched uh read on if you have read on uh baby peeps, you understand how to use the keto. But I'm not gonna be in the, uh criticizing the keto or anything here. I'm not here to analyze you any chart, but you can see how these are indicators there. I won't show you how to use the indicator here. I'm just showing you how to use the MetaTrader 4 platform. So this is your chart. And again, if you like want to check your price, click here. See the sign here? These are a dot to like fix out your price. These are the price line, price of the currency at the moment. Uh, Price of the currency at the moment is the line. This is all the SD price. So, uh, to add, let's say you want to trade. Oh, sorry. Firstly, the time frame. They have different time frame on Etherchain and four. So just tap on it. It will bring out the time frame. This is one minute, five minute, fifteen minute, thirty minutes, one hour, four hour daily time frame. Again. Uh, so you can just change your any time frame, four hour see this chart is different as it uh again if you want to trade let's say you got your signals if you want to trade you just have to click the plus sign how to trade then you see uh this is the lot size this is like the lowest uh lot size you can ever use on any broker and if you want to increase the lot size because lot size depend on how much you want to make and how much you want to load It'll increase money the uh, higher the loss size you use, higher the profit probability you can make. So, if you want to increase it, click this two sign. This is a 12 sign. Then, also, let's say uh, we want to sell, let's say we want to buy uh, our GSD right now. See, right? We want to buy it. Uh, yeah, and you want to use like maybe 0 0.50 lot. You just have to like click the buy. The order is placed. See here, yeah? this is where you see your order. And again, you are trading how to set your stop loss and TP. Go back to the chart, swipe it, uh, click the dot sign, fix out your stop loss. Uh, so again, if you always set your buy, 
if you buy definitely your stop loss is gonna be on uh, below your entry and if you sell your stop loss is gonna be above your entry so let's see one step i'll set our stop loss here zero six eight three six one go back to the chart go back to your balance area then swipe it you see the pencil sign oh sorry Zero six eight two eight five. See the pencil sign. This is the stop loss area. The red sign is stop loss area, and the green side is TP. So it's zero two eight five. You can only say two eight five modify. Done. You will see that your stop loss have been set. See it here. This is your stop loss as I said. Now remain your TP. How to set your TP? Go back to the chart. This is how you want your TP to be. Six eight seven three five. Six eight seven three five. Because your TP must definitely be above your entry. Six eight seven three five. Seven three five. It's done. See your TP now. Everything is modified. So definitely, if it's stop loss, if this starts to come below, this is your stop loss area. It will automatically trade. And if your uh, trade should come be, uh, above this area, it will automatically close in profit. And again, uh, once you open a trade, it's always fluctuating. Can you see this is on profit now? Zero zero dollars. No profit go back to lock this is where you check your chart history this is where you check your chart history let's say you want to like customize it if you have been trading for like past, last month it will bring your last month history see it here this is a demo account last month history loss to three uh two thousand three hundred deposit 5k uh balance now that's showing you this is the balance of this trade Uh, what else again? Okay, when you want to like switch to another account because you can have definitely many many accounts here yeah, on demo. Just click the manage account, then click the plus sign the way it is. And again, you can only swipe like this. Then see the charts, trade history, your main boss, and the economic calendar is here. And again, the uh, again the uh. MT4 community is there. How to log in, register, then log in. Uh, I think this video has explained a little bit on how to use Meta Uh Thank you guys for watching this video. I'm gonna be making more full video, expanding like explaining more on how to use Trading View. This is a Trading View platform. The background. This is a Trading View platform. That is it. So next video I'm gonna be showing you guys how to use trade the video.